Buhari is dead and buried in a shallow grave in Saudi Arabia. Aisha Buhari was there. She came back from what they call the lesser heart. She was wearing black. She was mourning. If you look at the pictures that were circulated at that, at that point in time, you will see the smog, or should I say, the forlorn faces of northern governors. A minute silence was held at the AU for a late Buhari. Even her Britannic Majesty, Queen Elizabeth II, also penned a condolence message to the people of Nigeria before the cabal took over and asked her to rescind it, which she did. Buhari is dead, and I'm prepared to stake Biafra on it. If you, Dele Momodu, can go and prove to me, I'm not asking you to do anything too complex. If you can go and ask this man you call Buhari, whoever it is in Asarok, to come outside, don't do very much, address a panel of Nigerian youths, maybe 20 of them, and speak Buhari's mother tongue, which is Fufude. I will give up Biafra. I will apologize to him and I will submit myself to any authority on this earth to do with me as they please. There is no Buhari. Jubril was there. Jubril followed Abakiri to Cuba and ran away from there and never came back. The man you have now in Asarok is from Niger Republic. His name is Yusuf Abubakar Muhammad. That's his name. Yusuf Abubakar Muhammad. Even Shekau knows who he is personally and was mentioning his name as well. It is not Buhari.